research is the fundamental underpinning of learning, have a range of projects within our center that are tackling some of the biggest problems. Basic science research at the very cutting edge of discovery, some of our researchers are engaged in scaling up innovations such as packaging, newborn interventions. Others are working on innovations to improve maternal nutrition. Our latest effort in this regards is also to help some global agencies in understanding the impact of various nutrition interventions on large-scale change. Our team at the Center for Global Child Health works to develop an innovative neonatal survival kit which comprises low-cost, evidence-based and easy-to-use interventions to improve newborn survival. The implementation of a new policy, intervention or program is supported by the generation of evidence-based research. So with the evidence we're gathering in our trials with our newborn survival toolkit, we hope to inform policymakers on the most effective and feasible interventions to improve newborn survival. I hope that we can show that the toolkit effectively reduces newborn mortality and that it contributes to optimal brain development in, in children. And if we succeed in showing this, what I hope we can do is to scale it up, to use it more widely both in Pakistan and in Kenya and in similar countries throughout the world. My research is focused on the health and nutrition of women during pregnancy and its impact on pregnancy outcomes and the health of infants. In collaboration with investigators at a research institute in Bangladesh, we are currently conducting randomized controlled trial of vitamin D supplementation in pregnant women and we're particularly focused on looking at its impact on the growth of infants. Our hope of course is that our research will produce results that can be incorporated into public health practice in the future. My primary work involves analyzing data and looking at what the best practices are to improve maternal newborn and child health outcomes. It's important to work in partnership with people because we don't necessarily have the research in the countries in which programs are being implemented, but we do have the expertise behind how to analyze that data. And that's where partnering with organizations like NGOs is beneficial. My work focuses primarily on following up on a birth cohort that, that we're just starting in Brazil. Research is the basis of decision-making and, and, and resource allocation. Without the evidence that it is generated to, through research, uh, one cannot properly decide how to prioritize health interventions in, the, in their countries and policies and understand what investments do make sense and which ones do not. This center offers a huge opportunity for young people to be engaged in scholarship, to be engaged in serious academic work, and to influence change in some of the key geographies where many of these problems are clustered.